Gruesome Heart Song. Hello, everyone. My movie today is called Boogeyman in 2005. Here's a movie that I remember it was a big thing. It was going into theaters. It's a bigger budget. Let's talk about it. Directed by Stephen K. Written by Eric Kripke. And the screenplay is by Eric Kripke and Juliet Snowden and Styles White. Here's the cast. Barry Watson as Tim. Emily Denschel as Kate Houghton. Sky McCole Barsuzak as Franny. Tori Masset as Jessica. And Andrew Glover as Boogeyman. And the cast goes on. I've seen this movie 18 years ago, and I just re-ventured it again. I wanted to see if my taste has changed from the first time I watched it. Boogeyman. There's actually a new one out that I just reviewed last week. Um, typical story. There's a uh, monster, Boogeyman, in Tim's closet in his younger. He's seen this monster. This monster... Well, they don't believe it, but he knows, he, he believes it, that the monster took his dad, the boogeyman did. Years later, during his whole time as a child, they said he was making it up, that he's seeing things, and da-da-da. He was recommended to go back to the old house where it, you know, where it happened, just get some therapy for it. In the meantime, there was a little girl that came to him and asked him, was it true that your dad was killed by the boogeyman? He's telling her to count to five. It works for him. It's a well-paced, well-put-together film. Great cast. As a matter of fact, Barry Watson, I know him from a series, Seventh Heaven. Um, yeah, so it's your typical boogeyman movie where nobody believes anything until they see that there actually is a monster in the closet or wherever. Lucy Lawless plays Tim's mother. She did a great job in that film as well. Again, I mean, you've seen one, you've seen them all. I guess you can say that. But I like to get a taste of the story. I mean, like I said, it's 18 years and I watched it again. It's still a good movie. It really holds up pretty well. One of the producers of the film is Sam Rami. You know him from the Evil Dead franchise. So there you go, folks. I mean, it's a really good movie. I mean, I'm not going to stand here and bash it. It's one of those typical creature feature films where there's a monster in the closet, and then it's a fight for survival. So definitely check it out. Boogeyman, 2005. This is Gruesome Herzog. I give this film a 7 out of 10. Very well acted. I'll be watching part 2 and part 3 as well. So they'll be coming down the road also. This is Gruesome Herzog. I'm out of here.